Hi there and welcome back or welcome to these videos on some basic guitar techniques. Very quickly I'm going to show you three chords which more than likely you'll know already. Those three chords are A, D and E. So for your A we've got three fingers in a row there like they're stuck together and they're all coming down the second fret on the fourth, third and second strings. So there they are all together, A. Three fingers together like this. The second fret, third, sorry, fourth, third and second strings. Then we use three fingers again to make a D chord. So on the second fret, our first finger is there on the third string. Our second finger is on the first string. And our third finger just tucks in front here onto the second string give us a D. So we've got an A to a D. And then we're going to do an E chord. And we slide down to the shape here. Our first finger is on the third string, on the first fret. Our second finger is up here, the fifth string, on the second fret. And our third finger tucks in just below here. Again, if you don't know already, these wires coming down here, dividing our guitar neck into boxes, are called frets. So that's the first fret, second fret, third, fourth, fifth, as they come up. And very often on guitars, you'll find a little dot marker to show you where the third and fifth frets are. And these continue on up the neck. Okay, so you've got your A your D, your E, and your A again. So a very simple arrangement of Song for Ireland. You can try strumming along with this yourself, or picking along. It starts on A. Walking all the day By tall towers where falcons build their nests in silver wings they fly They know the call of freedom in their breast Saw black head against the sky Where twisted rocks run down to the sea Living on your western shore Saw summer sunsets, I asked for more I stood by your Atlantic sea And sung a song for Ireland So that there is your first verse in your chorus of Song for Ireland With an A, a D and an E there's certainly more complicated ways to play it, using minor chords as well, but I've tried to strip all those out. And with my right hand over here, I was doing a picking pattern that involved my thumb and my first finger. So that's my A chord. That's my E, my D chord, sorry. And then my E chord. Okay, so I'm sure you'll be able to find your way around that. The A, the D and the E chord with Song for Ireland. The next song we've got is Curra of Kildare. And again, we have an A, a D and an E. And I'm going to do a very, very simple pattern for this one. Uh, and I'm just going to do down strokes like this. Very simple. Just down like that. And we're on the A chord. The winter it is past And the summer's come at last Small birds are singing in the trees. Little 
little heart so glad Oh, but mine is very sad For my true love is far away from me So it starts on an E The rose upon the briar And the tea water on an E clear Gives enchantment to the linnet and the bee. That's all on an E chord. Let me go to A. Their little hearts are A blessed. D, ah, but mine to no, no E rest. E, for my true love, D is far away from me. Chorus stays on E. And it's straight I will repair That's A, D To the colour of E, Coder Or to A For it's there I'll find tidings of my dear So a very, very simple arrangement An A, a D and an E The wind Till it is past, that's A. D, the summer's here, E, at last. Stay on that E. The small birds are singing in the trees, that's all E. Stay on the E. Their little hearts are A, glad. D, ah, oh, but mine is very E, sad. E. For my A true love is D far away E from me. Go to the chorus. And it's straight I will repair to the colour of Gildare. For it's there I'll find tidings of my dear. Apologies for the terrible singing. Uh, and also, I'm playing a very particular, simple rhythm, but you could change that to any other rhythm that you like, picking or strumming. Just have a bit of fun with it, and enjoy playing the guitar. Good luck, folks. <laughs>